is 192, but we have to find the third term using these two concepts. Third term, we write third term as A3. Third term is 24. It is given that it is 24. Sixth term, sixth term, we can write it as A6 and it is 192. 192 we are given. Question is, you have to find tenth term. We have to find tenth term. Term. Tenth term means A10. So, first of all, come to the first point. A3 is 24. A3 is what? AR3 minus 1. It is given 24. A6 is AR6 minus 1 is 192. We are using the concept. A n equals to A r n minus 1. Nth term, formula for the nth term. We use over here. Here n is 3, so we put 3 in place of n. Now, when we divide first and second equation, we get a r 3 minus 1 that is A r 2 upon A r 5 equals 24 upon 192 or we can cancel A A or we say that 1 upon R is to the power Q equals we can cancel this and this. One upon eight. So we write one upon R cube equals to one upon eight, or when we cross multiply, we say R cube equals to eight or R equals to two. So common ratio is two. We put this in equation one. When we put in one, what we get? A R raised to the power 2 equals 24 after putting R as 2 we get R A raised to A into 2 raised to the power 2 equals 24 or 4A equals 24 or A equals 6. Now if we have first term, if we have common ratio we can find any term since we are asking find the tenth term, so we use the formula A10 equals to AR9 and AR9, now we put the values A as 6, R as 2 raised to the power 9, 6 multiplied by, um, it is 2 raised to the power 6 into 2 raised to the power 3 only and we write the value. 2 raised to the power 6 is uh, 64 and it is 8. When we multiply, we get answer as 3072. Answer. So, what we have to do is, first of all, whatever we are given, we write the formula, we use the formula for this nth term and then we always divide. Whenever it is a case of geometric progression, we always divide the equation. After dividing, we get R. We put the value of R in any one of the two equations and we find A. If we have first term and the common ratio, we can find any terms. Any term. So here, since we are asking tenth term, so we put the values over here and we get 3072 as the required answer.